Good morning, everyone. With me today is Tanika Oliveira, who is our morning editor and also our fashion expert. And Tanika is quite the trooper. She always has asked me questions about agriculture and farming since you've been here. Yep. And you wanted to come out and ride the combine. I and, did. And so we thought we'd give you the full farming experience. Yes. First off, we had her come out and she you got to tailgate farmer style out there. We, yep. we gave you lunch. Yeah. Then, then, you, <laughs> then you said, we feed you and then we put you to work and, and we put you into the combine. Why do you, what's your interest uh, in, in agriculture and in, in wanting to drive this big combine? Here you're climbing in. Well, let me just tell you, first of all, thank you so much for giving me the opportunity to actually drive this thing, being crazy enough to let, to let me do <laughs> Look it. At her. I mean, because I, when I, <laughs> I was absolutely terrified. Which, which one's more feared there, me or you? Um, I think it's a, probably the both of us. You probably shouldn't be uh, in there at the same time driving. But right. um, yeah, for somebody who, who failed the driving test twice, because oh. I, I can't, can't parallel park, this was actually quite cool. But I, I really appreciated everything that goes into what farmers have to do to get food on our plates. You know, I mean, you, you wouldn't think that, you know, this takes so much, even just driving the combine. But from what you were telling me, you're in there for 10 hours at, you know, from uh, it, time. Sometimes more. Yeah. And, and, uh, That's we, a road trip. It, <laughs> it is, but uh, you did quite well. And if I could have had more time with you, I think, you know, you, you could have really gotten onto it. It's a big, big machine and there's a Very lot to big. keep an eye on. Yes. And, and uh, there I am trying to instruct you and, and it's a lot to take in at one time. But, one of the reasons you said you liked to, wanted to come out there is because you have somewhat of a fear of, yes. and, and you like to face your fears. We yeah. saw you swim. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and so you thought that cornfields might be something hiding out there or something. Yeah, yeah. Have, what, you haven't seen Children of the Corn? Uh, I've, I've <laughs> never heard of Crop one. Circles? <laughs> yeah, so I mean, I, I, I know it's a very ridiculous fear, but I'm terrified of what I don't, the unknown. Yeah. and. To me, that's what cornfields represent, the unknown. You never know what's gonna pop out of one of them <laughs> at any given time. So I, I felt like this was the opportunity for me to go out and well, face my fear. Well, it, you did very well. Thank, Thank you. you. And you saw the corn there at the light. And of Gorgeous course, our fashion color. expert says, uh, that I love the color of corn. I wish I had a pair of shoes. Absolutely, <laughs> of sir. Yes. <laughs> well, it was fun, Tanika, to have you come out and ride with us. And so uh, we had you milk a cow. We've milk had cow. you run the combine now. So run the combine. we'll see what's up next. So absolutely, the sky's the limit. Tanika, thank you so much. Thank we appreciate you. it. We had fun with you coming out. This is Agri Business Today, brought to you by Bomb Chevrolet Buick and Clinton, and by Tate and Lyle. I'm David Brown. Agribusiness Today on WAND is brought to you by Tate & Lyle, making a difference in our communities.